Welcome to First Congregational United Church of Christ, Boulder. This is the audio version of the weekly devotional. We hope you will tune in every week to listen to the latest offering written by a member of our congregation. Also, feel free to check out our YouTube channel to watch First Cong's Sunday church services. Thank you. Watching and Waiting by Karen Hoover As you read this meditation, we will be anticipating our worship together on the third Sunday of Advent. Christmas Day is fast approaching, and the season of waiting, so excruciating for children and harried for adults, will soon come to a close. But before it does, have we taken a moment to consider what it is that we as Christians are watching for? What is it that we are waiting for? After all, we know this story. We learned the story of the, the Nativity early in our lives, and we've experienced the Christmas season every year of our lives. Yet with each retelling of the story, I encounter different nuances which deepen and enrich the meaning of Jesus' birth in my own life. Perhaps it is the same for you. My faith understanding is that God sent Jesus to us in human form to show God's love for us and closeness to us. Jesus is not a deity on high. He was a human man who dwelt among us and became our teacher, teaching us how to love one another and how to embody that love through serving others, by responding to the needs of others with mercy, and by creating peace, by working for justice. And when Jesus gave his life as the ultimate sacrifice, he did not leave us. In the opening words of the Gospel of John, Jesus is the light of the world. I've come to think of Advent as a kind of annual refresher course. The celebration of Jesus' birth is my opportunity to renew my commitment to follow his teachings throughout the coming year. To do so, I must remain actively watchful for opportunities to act on my faith and not wait to respond. In this way, watching, and waiting are no longer passive activities. They come alive with possibility. Light giver, thank you for lighting our way by sending Jesus, the light of the world, to us. Strengthen us to be your light of service, mercy, justice, and peace in a weary world. Amen.